up YouTube back again with another exciting video so today I have a new storinator um, we're gonna be using uh, eight terabytes eight eight terabytes uh, HGSTs drives freaking awesome drives I love these guys um, I know they switched to uh, Washington Digital now owns them but I never had any problems with them I've been running them for at least eight years and never had one fail I got a super micro hard drive, hard drive, super micro server, there we go, um, and this super micro server has uh, dual, what was it, E2690s V3s, has a 3008 HPA, and has 64 gigs of RAM. So what I'm going to do is going to be installing ESXi um, uh, hypervisor, and then as a VM, I'm going to do a, a TrueNAS and import the uh, HBA into TrueNAS so I can see all the hard drives and not go through the virtual uh, hypervisor. I'm um, going to hook up everything up to 10 gig. Um, not sure how that's going to work yet because I don't have a switch. I'm going to try to you know, link them all, all my uh, VMs, uh, hypervisors together with no switch. We'll see how that works. Um, that's why this is going to be a couple part video. Um, I'm going to flash the BIOS. I'm going to you know, set it all up and hopefully catch it all on video and uh, we'll see how it goes. Stay tuned. All right, so this is the server. It's a 12 bay in the front. Uh, it has an additional four bays internal. And then towards the back, it has another two bay, um, two and a half inch drives. And that's only SATA, the rest are all SAS. Um, I do have SAS drives, they're 12 gigasecond SAS drives. They're only 7200 RPM drives, but um, should be more than enough than I, than I need. I also have um, M.2 riser, and I put a uh, one terabyte 970 EVO plus in there, which is also gonna be, that's gonna be my cache drive. Um, over here, I have that 3008 um, RAID controller, well, not RAID controller, HBA. Um, it's in IT mode, obviously. Um, and then I have, let me move this out of the way. Um, you got one CPU right down there, and then the second CPU there. Um, you got plenty of airflow. Um, it's a wicked nice setup. Uh, um, you know server so let's get to it also another thing i forgot to mention i did buy this thing off of ebay i'm not going to say who i bought it off of but they did it came with this bracket it's a full-size bracket that they cut and bent and they made it over there so i ended up just designing a uh, and printing out a 3d print version works perfectly fine lines up perfectly and it still has the ventilation for the holes so um it came out pretty good if you guys want um the file for that i can just throw it up on on the drive so you guys can grab it if you like um but yeah let's go ahead and flash the bios on this <laughs> 